Marcin's domain. Hey everyone, Marcin here, and I know I've already made two videos about the whole leak thing, and this will be my third one, but I wanted to keep the Smash hype going, and I thought if I talked about different aspects of the leak and just certain things about it, it could keep the hype up without it sounding redundant. So that's why I made the second video on how likely the characters are in the leak, without actually looking into if the leak is real or fake, just specifically looking at the characters. So I thought it'd be fun to actually talk about the whole Incineroar debacle. So a lot of people have been bringing up the fact that in that leak, there is no Incineroar. And a lot of people who claim to have inside sources say that they saw Incineroar in the game. And that Incineroar not being on the banner doesn't really add up. And I've seen a couple other YouTubers discuss this, but here's my take on it. I think that this Smash game will definitely have a new Pokemon. Every new Smash game has added new Pokemon to it. I don't think that trend will end here, especially considering the fact that Mock Rider is in the leak, showing the trend of keeping a random retro character in the game. I don't think they're gonna stop with the Pokemon trend. And also right now, Pokemon is a huge deal when it comes to Switch. We have that remake type game coming out soon. We have the brand new Pokemon game coming out next year. Pokemon Go can interact with the Switch with the game coming out this year. So they're going to be marketing Pokemon a lot when it comes to the Switch. And what I think is, is that whether it's Incineroar or not, I think a Pokemon is just going to come out as DLC. Whether it's free or paid, I have no idea. But I wouldn't be surprised if they held off on Incineroar or any Pokemon to have them added later to build up hype for the new Pokemon game. Because I'm not saying that I don't think Incineroar could get in, but I could also see Nintendo being like, you know what? Let's add a brand new Pokemon to the game. One that's going to be in the new game coming out next year. And that's where maybe they'd want to release that character to coincide with the new game, so they're going to wait to release that character. Because no matter what, I firmly believe this game will get DLC. It made so much money when it came to Smash 4 and DLC, there's no way they're not going to do it again. I don't care what any of them say about DLC in terms of Nintendo representatives. I don't care. Sakurai had stated before that he wasn't even planning on doing DLC when it came to Smash 4, and then look at how much DLC it had. And all the time he says, this is my last Smash game, and then he makes another one. I don't care what they say. This game's gonna get DLC. And if Incineroar is supposed to be in the game, or any Pokemon's gonna be in the game, and it's not on that banner, I think it's just because they're gonna be released later. I don't think Pokemon are completely cut from this game, Yes, we already have a lot of Pokemon, but with how Pokemon has been and what they're doing with it when it comes to the Switch, I think we're getting a new Pokemon character in this Smash game. Whether it's Incineroar or not, I mean, a lot of people are claiming that it's supposed to be Incineroar, but who knows, maybe they were gonna do Incineroar, and then they cut the character, and they were like, you know what? Let's do a different Pokemon to coincide with the new Switch game. So, that's my take on it. I don't think this makes it so the leak is fake. And also, who knows, maybe the sources that were telling these people about Incineroar, maybe they were wrong the whole time. Who knows? But either way, I think this game is going to get a new Pokemon, whether it comes out when the game is released or later. That is just to be determined. And I'm thinking more so that it's going to be coming out later, because I believe that that leak was real. So that's all I really have to say about this. Let me know in the comment section down below on what you think about all this. If you enjoyed this and you want to support me, feel free to subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you all later. Take care, everyone.